What we know about foam sclerotherapy is foam sclerotherapy is much better obviously at treating larger veins and smaller veins. Uh, so if you have liquid sclerotherapy, that's fine for about half millimeter veins for thread veins. So what, you, what we do is a handheld technique to inject under ultrasound into exactly the, foam, uh, the veins we want. We use STD as that's a very effective sclerosant and we don't use air. Uh, the trouble using air is you've got nitrogen in the air and if 80% of the, uh, the air is nitrogen, if that goes into your uh, system and you have a patent for amen ovale, then you have the risks of the transient ischemia and also a very small risk of a TIA. So to make a Tassari 1 in 4 mixture foam, use STD, sodium tetradecal sulfate. It's very important that we don't use the normal one, uh, the normal syringes we use without the low lock, because of the pressures we use, the foam will go everywhere. We now have this situation. We don't want to start mixing them yet until we just offset this to get more turbulence. When we then start moving it with 10 passages, maybe a bit more turbulence, there we are, with 10 passages in total, we end up then with foam that you can see coming out like that. We then use a blue needle and then under ultrasound control, little pinprick coming in, we just slide into the, the knee, slide the needle into the vein. What we're going to do is we put an eccentric pressure, so this is a hypoallergenic collar and cuff. This is panel haft, which has got no stickiness on it, it's got no glue, so you can't be allergic to the glue in it.